Hey everybody! Hey everybody! What is up? Welcome to live game night. <laughs> I am so excited for you guys all to be here because we are playing Larkana. Yes, we are. I, which is the brand new uh, Disney game that has come out by Ravensburger, and it's a trading card game. And mm -hmm. it, I feel like it's been like all the talk lately, and I'm really excited to dive into this. It is, yeah. yeah. So we've actually had this game for over a month now. Yeah. Um, so we actually picked it up at Gen Con, uh, which we did cover and we, we talked about it a little bit there, but we kind of wanted to wait to do more coverage until it was more accessible. We didn't want to pressure people into feeling like they yep. had to buy $5,000 cards. So, <laughs> um, well, here we are. I mean, you know, it's, it's about as available as it's going to be. Um, <laughs> so we would love to just kind of like play through it now, uh, talk about it. Uh, we'll probably play like what, like best out of three, something like that. That's the official rules. Yeah. It's uh, mm -hmm. best out of three. So I think that's what we're okay. gonna do. But while people are hopping on, as we you are shuffling up your cards, yes. um, uh, <laughs> this is a thing I've started to like to do for the live streams is ask like would you rather questions. So this is for people <laughs> in the chat as well. Um, so these are I made them all Disney themed today. Okay. So all right, this is for you guys. Let me know your opinion too. Yeah. All right, Jonathan doesn't know these. Hey right. Leon, how's it going? Hey. <laughs> Thanks for coming in. All right. So Jonathan and everyone, first question: Would you rather cook with Tiana in Louisiana or Remy in Paris? Oh, <laughs> it's easy, Tiana, <laughs> any day. Really? I gotta get my gumbo and beignets. Oof. I can taste it now. That sounds so good. Yeah, I'm, I'm not a fan of French food. The portions are too small. That's true. I think I would like to, I really love Princess and the Frog, but I think I'd want to do a uh, Coco Grammy. Okay. I just love, I, that would be really cool. Okay, <laughs> and, the question, and then you guys can chime in too with what you guys think, but I'll probably, oh, Tiana. All right, all right. Got, Thank you. Got another vote for Tiana. Uh, so, now question number two. Would you rather ring bells with Quasimodo, or paint walls with Rapunzel? Oh my gosh. <laughs> I, I thought it was an easy one until you said, ah, oh, man. Being as I'm not that much of a painter, I, I'm gonna go with ringing the bells. It sounds fun to go swinging from all the bells. Really? Okay, yeah. It's like, it's like, sounds like a lot of hard work though, I honestly. could be day out there. I mean, yeah. they're both like trapped. So it's like That's true. Wow. There's a lot of parallels between those two. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh <laughs> thanks, Super Hero Crew, for joining us from work. Really appreciate that. Yeah, awesome. What's going on? <laughs> All right. So uh, the chat is slightly delayed, so I'm just going to go on to the next question. Oh, French food all the way. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Question number three. Would you rather clean up after the evil two stepsisters in Cinderella or the seven little men in Snow White? Ooh, these are good questions. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna go with um, after the seven little men. Yeah, because I feel like I feel like they're not that messy. Like they, they whistle and work and they yeah, I don't know. I feel like that'd be good. I feel like I go with them too because even though they might be really messy, they'd at least say thank you. Yeah. Probably. Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Rapunzel don't like heights. That's a good point. Like if you don't like heights, then well, she is up in a tower though. But I guess like if you were trapped, if you, the windows were closed. That's true. Mm -hmm. would, hope you wouldn't get uh, lightheaded from the paint fumes. <laughs> These are good questions. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. This is question. This is the last question, and then we'll dive into Lorcana. All right. Question number four. Would you rather have the small world? theme song stuck in your head for the rest of your life or the Mickey Mouse March theme song which is like M-I-C-K-U-I-M-O-U-I-C Mickey Mouse I'd probably go with that one that one? <laughs> yeah you know they have that one stuck I like in that head. song you know I can I can trot down the street to it I could I could get behind that I already okay. sing that sometimes okay <laughs> all right okay nice. so that is our little icebreaker to jump into this uh, so Jonathan do you want to kind of give an overview of what even this whole whole game is that people have been talking about. Yes, I would be happy to. Uh, so this is Disney Lorcana, the first chapter. Uh, so this is a trading card game. So I go to the store, you get these booster packs, you open them up, you don't know what card, 12 cards you're going to get. Uh, some of them are going to be uh, common cards, some of them are going to be rare, and some of the cards are going to have really cool like synergies between each other. Um, now it's a uh, like a playing card game that we would play against each other, head versus head. Uh, there is also more than that. You could play a three or four player. 
um, but uh, it's kind of like Pokemon or Yu-Gi-Oh or Magic the Gathering or any of these other kind of games with a Disney spin. Um, so uh, there are six different ink colors, uh, so the cards are one of six colors, mm -hmm. and you can make a deck out of two colors. Um, so I've made a deck of yellow and purple, which is amethyst and amber, I believe, yes. uh, and you have a deck of... Uh, ruby and sapphire, which is, for the normal people, red and blue. <laughs> <laughs> very nice, very nice. So you can have, at minimum, 60 cards. I think I've got like 63 in here. Um, I think so, yeah. I, I actually think I did too. On a little bit over. I couldn't um, decide. <laughs> but people say you're not supposed to go over 60 because then your deck gets too flooded, but I just had too many good choices. And I get too, too emotional about these characters because they're Disney characters. I know. <laughs> yeah, if you guys are Disney fans, um, then uh, yeah, it's awesome. I would love to know, has anyone gotten a chance to play it yet? Like, let me know, or if like you're just wanting to see how the game is played and like how it all works. Um, yeah. But we've been able to play through it several times now, and mm -hmm. we both have gotten the bug. I would say, like it, it like honestly, yeah, you definitely more than I thought have, I would. Like, di like dove real deep into this. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, the like collector piece scares me a little bit about it. I think I think we can kind of calm down a little bit. Um, I am excited to like. I feel like my deck's gotten to a pretty good place. We've been fortunate enough to find some um, some cards and boosters at fairly reasonable prices, plus the cards that we got from Gen Con. So, um, yeah. Yeah, Leon's talking about um, uh, the cost of it is hard to get into, but like as more chapters release, they want to get into it, which yes, I would exactly. say is fair. And they're going to do a reprint of this edition, and they have said that there's gonna be no changes to it. It's gonna be identical to the first edition. Mm -hmm. So hopefully, I know Robinsberger's goal is to make this as successful as possible. I think it, everyone was, I think they were overwhelmed as well with like how excited everyone was <laughs> about this game. Yeah, well, we know that they were so excited about the release. So yes. It's, it's been really fun to see that there have been a lot of people who've been really enjoying it. Yes. Um, so I've, I've drawn my starting hands. I'm going to make some changes to it yeah. though. Uh, um, so Jonathan, are they seeing overhead? Um, they will be seeing overhead. Mm -hmm. So Jonathan's Boom. playing with <laughs> sleeves that are like Lurkana sleeves. I'm actually playing with um, the sleeves from <laughs> uh, the Ep Sorcerer's Arena Epic Alliances, which mm -hmm. is not by Robinsberger. It's actually by the op, but I could like I really, really like these sleeves and like they're super yeah. themed and they're shiny. So that's what we're going with. <laughs> so how you start your game is you shuffle up your deck and then you are going to draw out seven cards. Now, according to the rules, your first hand can be a mulligan. You can discard as many as you want and put them underneath and then redraw that amount. Yes. Can so. you explain the overall aim, or do you want to do a practice turn, or how? Yeah, we can just kind of jump in and, and play some. Um, the gist of it is um, that uh, you have cards that have uh, like an ink cost. Um, uh, that's how much it costs to play that card. Um, now you were kind of like a master painter. Hey, don't look at my cards. Oh, I was. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> You're like a, a master painter who's uh, coming up with these glimmers of characters. So it's like, it's not the actual character itself. It's like a glimmer of them. Uh, so you can have multiple of the same character that's out. Uh, and you can also like cast their ink into your inkwell, uh, which is what your spending power is to play more cards. Um, so any of the cards that have a gold border around the cost, uh, that means that it can be placed in your inkwell face down. When you do that, you show your opponent which card you're placing there. Uh, and you can place at most one ink per turn, and that ink is what you can spend to play those cards. Um, so I think we could just play a game, and I think it, it's, it's fairly straightforward. Um, so, yeah, how do you feel? Yeah. Good? <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Um, oh, people would like to know, uh, how, what is the minimum purchase needed for two players? Yes, the minimum purchase needed is two starter packs, I would say is the, the most cost efficient way if you can find them. Uh, the starter packs are MSRP $16.99. Uh, stores are selling them reasonably up to $24, uh, and that gets you a full pack of cards that you need to play as a single person. Uh, and then it also comes with a booster pack with 12 random cards that you'll get. Uh, so you can get two of those, hopefully for around like $30, $40, uh, and that's your kind of starting point for the game. And that was a, a pretty much all we had for a long time. So. Yeah, that's what we started with, and I've combined mm -hmm. mine. Usually, the per blue and red come separately, but I've combined them together. So. Yeah, cool. Okay. Okay, so right, do you want to go so first or second? Um, I want to go second. Okay, so that means I don't get to draw on my first turn. Mm -hmm. uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna ink Anna. Okay. So she's gonna go there. 
I'm gonna spend her and I'm gonna play Hey Hey for cost one. <laughs> My little Hey Hey uh, is a support, so it's very, very weak, but every time that Hey Hey quests, uh, then I'm gonna add uh, Hey Hey's strength to another character, which can challenge. Uh, and questing, by the way, that's how you win the game. We, we never talked about right, that. Right, that's how you win the game. <laughs> how you win is by getting 20 lore. Uh, so I got this made on Etsy. This does um, not come <laughs> the game. But yes, once you get 20 lore, uh, which the way you do that is on your turn, you spend your character to quest, which is this little like lore symbol here. Um, that's how you're gonna get those points. And there's a number of other things you might do with your character, such as like uh, challenge another character. I don't know if you but, guys can see it, but mm -hmm. it's basically, it's what, if you can see this here, it's these little diamond shapes that are on the edges of the cards. I don't know if they can see them, it's too far away, yeah. but yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so my turn? Yes. Okay, so I would reset, ready, set, and then I'm going to draw first. Okay. Okay. I'm going to ink Pongo oh. as my, okay. I know, as my ink. <laughs> and then I'm going to play Minnie Mouse. Nice. For one. Okay, sounds good. So I'm gonna draw up a card at the start of my turn. She's so cute. She is cute. Um, I'm going to, oh, it's so early to have this card. I know, that's, oh. that's what I started with. Okay, you know what? We're just gonna, so I think we're just gonna do the it. The balance of this game, like choosing to like <laughs> discard no, cards no. for your ink, that like <laughs> to have, be able to play other cards is, is, is yep. where the challenge lies. All right, I'm gonna play Yzma. Okay. And then I'm going to quest with Hey Hey, so I get my first point. Okay. Mm -hmm. Your turn. So Minnie is now on the scene. That ink, I'm gonna draw up. So I now have two spending power because I put ink in. Now you don't have to put ink in every turn, but you can only put one ink in per turn. <laughs> so many good, terrible choices. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna ink Jasmine. Cool. To bring out my shield of virtue. Oh, nice, that's a good one. Okay. So, can't use them yet because I need three to be able to use that item, but I'm just gonna quest with mini. Okay. And go up one point. Alrighty. I'm gonna draw up. Oh my goodness. Okay, so first of all, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to quest with Hey Hey, so, or with Yzma. Um, so Yzma lets me look at the top card of my deck, and then I can keep it there, or I can put it back on the bottom. I'm definitely keeping it. Uh, and then I'm going to... Uh, Deadman, you're asking if the game is Jetson. officially out. It is out. Tech <laughs> it is out, but like it's really hard to find now because like it was like really been bought out i would say oh, you can still find it in some uh, local game stores um but they're planning on doing a reprint um but then the second set is supposed to come out in november uh yes november yeah. they're gonna come out every three months with new cards so yep. <laughs> um gonna make a very difficult choice i'm going to take simba and put him in my ink okay and i'm going to play friends on the other side and i'm gonna draw two cards cool and then that's my turn. I'm also going to quest with uh, Hey Hey and get my second point. Okay, we do this. Who do you have out of Hey Hey? He's mine, Hey Hey. Two and one. Can draw. <laughs> My cards over here, so you can see what's going on. Hmm. What are you thinking? I am going to ink Aurora, and I am going to play Mickey Mouse for three. Cool. Yeah. When you play this character, I may take the card from the top of my deck and immediately I don't get to look at it down into my inkwell. Yeah, cool. So that is how he works. And then I'm... I'm gonna take a damage to Hey Hey. Damage to Hey Hey? Yeah. Okay, cool. 
Damage is in. Yes, and there's some mention about using dice as counters. You could use a d20 to count your score, it's correct. Uh, people also tend to use like a regular like d6 dice to uh, count damage as well. Comes with these little like paper damage counters that are very thin. <laughs> we have these little dials that I, that I found on How Etsy. are you going to do your damage? I'm gonna do mine at three and then count down. Okay. Does that work um, for you? Yeah, I can do that. Okay. Sure, we'll do a countdown. All right. So you so you took one damage then yep. on, on mini. Okay, sounds good. Cool. I'm going to draw, draw. <laughs> uh, ooh, I'm glad I didn't do the thing I was gonna do earlier. Okay, I'm going to, um, first of all, these are gonna come back. I'm going to spend three to play friends on the other side yet again. <laughs> Gonna draw. That card is so good. It is a very good card. Um, I'm then going to ink Sebastian, and then I'm going to spend it to play Lilo. All right, and then Hey Hey is gonna quest. Um, there we go. And then Isma is going to quest as well. And then whenever Isma quests, I get to look at the top card on my deck. And I'm gonna put that on the bottom. All right, cool. Okay, reset everybody, bring everyone back up. My ink. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> okay, I am not going to ink and I am just going to pay four to bring out the eyes of fate. Chosen character gets plus one this round. And so I'm gonna give that to Minnie. So she is going to get two. two okay, four. cool. Thank you. And cause this is an item I can immediately use it. I don't have to wait a turn. Okay. And yep. then I'm also going to, I'm gonna take out Hey Hey with my Mickey. With your Mickey? Yeah. Okay. Bam, bam. All right, I'm dead. You take one damage. Yep. <laughs> okay. Bye, hey, hey. I'll miss you. <laughs> All right, my turn? Mm -hmm. Okay, draw on this back. Ooh, tough choices, tough choices. Okay, I'm gonna spend four to play Jetsam. I'm going to use Yzma to I got a quest. All right, yeah, so I'm gonna quest so I can look at the top card of my deck. Um, I'm gonna keep it there. So I'll get my point. And then Lilo here is also going to quest for two points. Ta-da! Okay, I need a quest. <laughs> oh, hang on. Wait. No. You done? <sighs> uh... I'm gonna, I'm gonna not quest with Lilo. I'm gonna keep her up. Okay, all right, your turn. <laughs> all right. There is a question, I, if you wanna answer it while I am. Yeah, sure. Doing that. Uh, I heard, uh, so I've heard about different colors of cards. Um, yes, so each of the different colored cards, um, you'll notice I'm playing with purple and yellow cards. Um, so that's the amber and amethyst decks. Um, you're playing with the ruby and sapphire, which is the red and the blue decks. Uh, each deck has a little bit different flavor, like a little bit different things that they do. They also come like um, more heavily to certain movies or certain films. Um, and then uh, each deck has like a totally different play style. Like I'd say the yellow, I'm, I have not done any research on this, so this is just what I feel. Uh, yellow feels very like support heavy, like healing other characters, things like that. Uh, gray is like very militaristic, like the steel cards are like all fighters it feels like. Um, and then purple has a lot of utility. Um, so I have like a lot of special abilities that my characters have. And I'd say your red characters, um, you have a lot of like evasive characters. Um, it's like one of um, the things you have. It's pretty red cool. I feel like has a lot of items. Or items, a lot of yeah. like things that don't count um, for ink. Which yeah. Is interesting. Mm -hmm. So the evasive characters are ones that can't be targeted by other characters true, unless too. they're also evasive, which is what Jetson is. Yep, and you yeah. can only have two colors in your mm -hmm. ink deck. Okay, so I'm gonna walk through my turn because it's gonna Go get it. crazy. Okay, so I am going to quest with Minnie first. Okay. So she gets one. And then I am going to 
quest with Mickey, he also gets one. Nice. This is hard to move. Okay, and then I'm going to use my, oh shoot, I meant to use okay, the so eyes of fate, extra. so I would have gotten an extra you one. You spend ink for that? Nope. Oh, you don't have to spend ink for that one? Nope. Nice, that's awesome. So I'm at six, and then I'm gonna use my three ink by activ to activate the Shield of Virtue again, and I am going to do this. Oh, <laughs> I'm gonna do it on with many again, and I'm gonna take out Lilo. Lilo didn't oh. quest. <laughs> That's what oh, I decided you're right. not to do. <laughs> so you wanna do something else then? Uh, I'm just gonna do damage with Mickey on uh, okay. Yzma. Okay, sounds good. So I'll take one damage. Okay. All right, cool. We're back. That's why I didn't want to lose you, Yzma. Um, Lulu. Okay, I'm gonna take Jetson. I'm gonna put him in my little inkwell. I'm gonna pay Can't two. She has, she's a two quester. Yeah. Yes, she she's so slow in health. I'm gonna play Simba, who's a bodyguard. Um, so bodyguards have to be hit first. Uh, you can't hit my other characters. Um, Lilo is going to quest now. Um, and Yzma is going to quest, so that's one, two, three, lore. Um, and that lets me look at the top card of my deck, and yeah, I'm keeping that there. Um, you have so many cards to look at the top of your deck. <laughs> yeah, I, I do. Ah. Um, and I'm gonna go ahead and take out your, I'm taking out your Mickey. Wham. All right, so Mickey is, is dead. Yes, dead man, you can only, typically, you can only attack characters if they've been like tapped um and mm -hmm. uh but so if they're turned sideways however there are some characters that like are exceptions to those rules will have powers that can go in like get them if they haven't been tapped yet that's right but generally yep. that's the rule yep um i'm also going to go ahead and just play a magic broom as well which lets me sweep one of these cards back into my deck um i may do it oh, snap i'm not gonna do it i have a reason not to <laughs> you done? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. What you got? I'm going to pay three to do take a bite, and I'm going to spend one of my my last one to be able to use take a bite this turn. And I'm going to no, I'm just going to save that. You save it? I'm going to save it. Right? Sounds good. Yeah. So you're looking for a princess then. Yeah, I'm looking for a princess. That's where okay. that's better. Okay, but I am... But you could also exert just to attack, which is good. Yeah, so but all of yours are exerted. Yeah. Except your magic broom. Mm-hmm. Mm. You gotta go for Simba though. He's a bodyguard. How much health does Simba have? Three. Oh, he's so strong. <laughs> he's okay. working on his roar. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna kind of do the same thing I did last time. I'm going to do damage to... Um, I'm going to do him for his lore. Uh, so that's a one, so that's a seven. Oh, didn't I take out Mickey? I took Mickey out. You did? Yeah, with Jetson. <laughs> then I'm gonna do, give, spin that to do mini one. There's a question about how we feel about the balance of the game. Um, it is possible to get a deck that's a lot stronger than someone else's deck. I think that's why in various levels of competitive play, they have like, open play, family play, they have like a, um, constructed decks is like one way you can play where you get to bring your own deck from home. There's also um, like a one where you like pass booster packs around and you take one card and, and pass it. So um, like, a, like a draft play. Um, and yeah, so that's a good way to, to balance things. Yeah, but I would say like we're, we've both gotten to a point where our decks are both like pretty meaty. They're both like pretty good. Yeah. So hard yeah. though <laughs> I mean it's just like a lot of hard like decisions like giving things yeah. up but we miss yeah. what you want in a game yeah okay so now your favorite part is here um, so I'm gonna spend four to play Mickey Mouse 
<laughs> I'm gonna spend one to play this magic broom. Oh, um, wait, I don't mean to like rain on your parade, but I got plus one because I used the fates. Can I add that? Yeah, 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 do okay. it, do it. Um, so Mickey Mouse plays magic brooms for one less. So now I'm playing these for cheaper. <laughs> um, I also, whenever magic brooms are banished, they come back to my hand. Um, so that will be a thing moving forward. Um, cool. So I'm gonna go ahead and quest, and I'm gonna quest, um, and I'm going to, um, let's go ahead and use, I'm, I'm gonna take out Minnie Mouse and take your damage here. No, Minnie, yeah, you did so much for me. <laughs> and then, so that's, hold on, so that's you had a good one, fight, two, Minnie. three. You did great. You're shiny. Here. And then Yzma here is gonna quest as well. Oh my gosh. Which is gonna have items on my look board. at the top card of my deck and yep, I'm gonna put that back on the top of my deck. <laughs> and then um, I'm going to quest um, with my magic broom. I'm gonna quest, oh wait, I can't, I can't play this magic broom yet. Uh, I just played this Mickey, so yep, that's it. Okay. Uh oh. <laughs> oh my gosh, so how many? Wait. I'm at 13 out of 20. How many Lord do you have on the board? Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. <laughs> That's a one turn victory. No. Action. I'm gonna have to do it. Pay five. Okay. Oh, I was also gonna do him his ink. I'm gonna banish Mickey. Mickey's not a princess. It's oh, banish chosen, chosen character. character. Oh, snap. Mickey to the dungeon. All right. <laughs> Very nice. And that's all I can do because we literally just have okay. items on the board. Sounds good. So we'll come back to me. I think we can still end this, right? Let's see, what do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And I need seven. Yeah, so that's victory. Um, but First one. I'm gonna spend my three and I'm gonna play part of your world. I'm gonna put Mickey back in my hand. <laughs> <laughs> and that's it. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and quest. That's game. All right. So 20 lore. We've done it. We snuck away. My problem is I had five cards when I drew up of um, that can ink. Oh um, snap! You got so too many of those I have in your too deck. Too many of those in my deck. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So the um, just as a reminder there. So some cards have like a, a gold swirl around them. That's the cards that can be put into your ink well. If it doesn't, it's typically a little bit stronger for its price, um, but you can't ink it, so you only have the choice to play it. So mm -hmm. that's a tough one. So that was, we're gonna play best two out of three. So we're gonna run through another game just so you guys can see more cards. And yeah. like, that's the official like tournament rules. It's best two <laughs> out of three. So it's so a pretty quick game. I haven't lost yet. Yeah, <laughs> it's not too bad. Not too bad. All right, cool. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and. And uh, these are um, Lorcana mats. Uh, we yes. were lucky enough to be able to get them when we were at Gen Con. Yeah. That was a really fun event. Uh, if you didn't see that video, go back and, and check it out. There was a, a Lorcana party where we got to um, celebrate with the designers and the artists of the game. Uh, that Mickey card that she just had uh, was done by Nicholas Cole, who's such an incredible artist. He did one of my favorite Elsa cards too. Um, but we got to meet him and hang out with him. Yeah. as well as the two designers. And which speaking awesome. of which, full, full disclosure, because we didn't talk about this at the beginning of the video, some of these cards that we're playing with, uh, they were provided to us by Ravensburger and Disney. Yeah, so at that game. Some yeah. of them um, mm -hmm. we have paid for ourselves, and then some of them in the deck are from them. Yeah, it's a mix of both. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Cool. The sleeves, my sleeves are not from them, obviously. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> oh man, we're gonna get so much trouble. Bootleg sleeves. <laughs> Homemade lore counters. I think they're fun though. They're cool. I'm also wearing uh, Etsy ears. Yeah, there is an official like lore counter that looks really cool, but it's um, not. You can't get it. You get it from like rewards from tournaments right now. Oh really? Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, so you show your cards that you're inking. Uh, I guess partially to show them that you're allowed to ink it. Yeah, that would be a good reason. But the other interesting reason is. Um, if they're counting, so you can have up to four copies of the same card in your deck. Um, so if you see me start inking like a certain card, you know I have less of that card in my deck, so you know it's not gonna come back. Um, so it's kind of a nice like way to know, okay, cool, so you're not gonna play that many of those cards on me. Um, yeah, cool. 
Five, six. Seven. All right, do you wanna go first or second this time? Do you wanna go first? Let me look first. I think technically I should go first. Okay. Sounds good. Just gonna look at my hand, see what I got. Uh, I'll get the heck out of here. All right, I'm getting rid of two cards. They are too expensive. All right. Might as well. Okay. All right. Cool. What do we got? Okay. <laughs> Shuffling I like know. a maniac. Okay. I know. All right, go for it, dude. You All right. Okay. I'm going to ink with this coconut. Cool. And I'm bringing my faithful girl back on the screen. <laughs> and there is Miss Minnie. Minnie's back. And I need not get to draw up because I am first player. Okay, sounds good. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and take uh, a little Sebastian here and put it in my ink. And then that's, oh, I get to draw at the start of my turn. Uh, yep, that's the end of my turn. Yeah. Okay. She is now on the team. I am drawn up. I am going to... So for folks who have seen cards, who is your favorite character that you've seen on a card so far? I would say, oh gosh, for me, I think it's your your Mickey uh, is probably the coolest card I've seen. It's like Mickey the Brave Little Tailor. <laughs> oh yeah. It's a very cool card. I'm using there the ink. Okay. And then... Though I do like the like Sorcerer Mickey. Phil is coming out. Nice. <laughs> All right, and then... Uh, you have nothing on the board, so I'm just going to use Minnie to quest. Okay, cool. Yeah, so characters can't be used the turn that they're played. They've got that summoning sickness. Um, here we go. And Phil's neat power, whenever this um, Phil quest, I may add their strength to a chosen character. Yeah. Which is very cool thematically. That is cool. All right, Sebastian's going in again. Sorry, Sebastian. I don't need your singing abilities right now. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and play... Um, we're gonna go ahead and play um, Bodyguard attempt, Simba. Attempt the, there's <laughs> like themed writing at the bottom of every card. Um, there is. Courage comes in all sizes. No, you got scared. <laughs> that's a lame one. You got scared. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want, so, okay, that's actually a pretty dangerous part of this game is like you'll get cards like this in your hand and you'd be like, oh, I wanna sing that. And then you start singing it and then they know exactly what you have in your hand. <laughs> it's the fatal flaw of this game. <laughs> is he a bodyguard? Yes, he is. He's out. <laughs> Okay. Um. Whoa, your fill is so strong. That's cool. Yeah, he is. That's wild. I All like right, that. I am going to Aurora. Ink, okay. And then I am going to bring Mr. Aladdin out. Okay. And then I'm going to quest with Minnie. Okay. And then if I am going to, no, I'm going to quest with Phil, and then I'm going to send Phil's strength over to Minnie. So now she's a four. So I'm gonna okay. take out, <laughs> right. I'm gonna take to do the damage. Okay. And then Minnie took how much damage, sorry? Did you um, have two? Two, yep. So Minnie takes two. Okay. Cool. Sweet. Okay. And then I, yeah, that was great. Yeah, make sure you, yeah. boop. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. Very nice. I'm gonna draw. Draw. Here we go. Did I draw that turn? Um, probably. People in the comments, did I draw that turn? I don't remember. <laughs> probably. Uh, Nothing looks new. Let's see. Mm. I'm gonna go ahead and play, um, I need some more cards in this hand. Okay, we're gonna play Jetsam as ink. We're gonna spend that ink. We're gonna play Friends on the other side. Draw some cards. Okay, I'm good with that. Oh, when I play this character, each opponent loses a lore. Did you gain any lore last turn? 
No. Oh, you have zero characters on the board. I have no lore. Interesting. Yeah. That means that you're plotting. <laughs> Maybe. Don't like that. <laughs> okay, everyone comes back. I'm going to draw. Remember it this time. Oh, they're asking if by some weird chance have we seen any similar abilities and powers in Lorcana as abilities in Villainous. Have you seen anything that felt like just like Villainous? Theming wise? Yeah. I feel like there's probably something. Um, yeah, I'll see if there's any I'll cards. See if, I'll look at the quotes. Some I mean, of the like quotes, definitely. Maleficent's in here, and that's very cool. Um, Captain Peter, Hook's Captain is double the pattern. Captain Hook's not really <laughs> as much in these decks. He's a lot more in green and gray. Gray, yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, so Mickey Get a Clue came out, so I was able to ink oh, nice. one blindly. Okay. And then I'm going to do You're the just same. Questing. Oh, I'm just questing. One, two, yeah. three. Okay. Get your quests. Okay. All right, I'm gonna, I'm going to. Thank oh, you. I hate to do this. I did draw last turn apparently. Oh, okay, <laughs> nice. I'm gonna ink the, um, oh man, this is so hard. Okay, I'm gonna ink this Elsa. Interesting, Phil giving you power made you think of that. Uh, does his, I haven't played Hades in a while. Does his card do that? I assume. Do what? Um, give like other characters power. Play friends on the other side. Um, does, wait, whose card? Sorry. Phil. Yeah, he does. He gives them strength. No, no, in Villainous. Oh, I don't remember. That's what yeah. I'm thinking. Okay. I got Lilo. The out. same deck colors, um, someone's asking, the same deck colors can play against each other. Yes, they can. Mm hmm. Okay. I, we haven't really done it, so I'm not sure how the balance would be, but yeah, they can play against each other. Yep. You done? I'm done. It's Lilo. Okay. It's Lilo. Boop, 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 boop. Goodness gracious. So you got five? I see how I can come back from this. I definitely made some missteps in the beginning of this one. <laughs> I think we're back though. Develop your brain. Yeah. <laughs> that wasn't an insult. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm spending all nice. five to bring Aurora. I love this card it is so shiny i don't know it's going to show up on camera as pretty as it is yeah but it's like dreaming guardian so i can um if i had played another aurora i could have played uh this aurora cheaper on top of her she's kind of like evolving that's like the really neat thing it's kind of like pokemon in that sense but the other this character also gains ward which means other character uh, jonathan can't um like he can't attack my other people except yeah. if he's challenging them but mm -hmm. she's not in play yet so, quest, uh, you're weak, so. <laughs> What? You can't attack me yet. Oh, oh, I can't. Yeah. It's really annoying. Okay, so I'll just quest. Okay. La la la. One, two, three, four. All right. Get your last little bit of questing. <laughs> evil okay. laugh. Yep. All right. Um, okay, I'm gonna take Ariel. I'm gonna put her down here. I'm gonna spend five and put in Maximus as a bodyguard. And I'm gonna get two points of lore. Automatically? Uh, it automatically Questing with Lilo. I just quested with Lilo. Oh no, oh, with Lilo. Okay. Yeah, so there's a bodyguard, so it's injured, exerted, so you have to attack okay. Maximus first. You're protecting Nay. the child. <laughs> <laughs> you bet. I'm gonna catch up now. Two to nine. <laughs> All right, there's song cards. Can any character sing the songs? Yes. Um, so for instance, Friends on the Other Side that I played, I could pay three to, to sing the song. I can also exert a character of cost three or more to sing the song. It does not matter which character does it. Um, so the other day I was playing, I used Mickey to sing that. I was like, I got friends on the other side. <laughs> <laughs> sung it like Mickey. So I always try to sing it like the character whenever yeah. we're playing. Like Maleficent, <laughs> I just did, she had no invitation and needed no introduction. I love nice. it. Okay, but I played her and for five and now I am going to quest. 
I'm just gonna do the questing at the end. So I'm gonna quest with um, Minnie. Mm -hmm. I'm going to quest with Phil, but I'm going to give his extra strength to... Oh, dang. I can give it to Aladdin, mm -hmm. who can take out uh, Maximus. Shoot, Phil is so strong. All right, Aladdin's dead too. Yeah. <laughs> oh man, that's brutal. But okay. I can then, um, I'm gonna use Mickey to attack Lilo. Oh shoot, okay, Lilo's dead. And then I'm going wait, to wait, use- Wait, wait, he didn't die. Oh. Yeah, he only takes one damage. Here you go. You good? Okay. Yes, and then I'm going to quest with Aurora, so it's four. Dang. Okay, this is not going well. I did not see that coming. Okay. Man, I never played with Phil. I just added him to my deck. He's yeah, nice. Phil's freaking strong. <laughs> um, oh, snap. This is looking pretty good. Okay. We're going to add Magic Broom to our little thingy down here. And then we're going to... Um, we're going to put Elsa out. And then we're going to sing Part of Your World. And we're gonna bring Lilo back into my, actually, yeah, we're gonna bring Lilo back into my hand. Okay. Dang, two to 13. I don't know how I'm gonna come back from this one. I think you got me beat. I should have just put out cheap stuff. I'm going to play the Eyes of Fate for four. That's a good item. <laughs> and then, yeah, because it doesn't get banished. It's so good. Okay, going to quest with Minnie. Okay. Going to quest with Phil. I'll come back to him. Mm. Yeah, quest with him. I don't need to though. Have you won? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, oh, eight. Oh, I think I have. Yeah, you won. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, yeah. Boom. Yay! Decimated. Oh snap! <laughs> oh snap! All right, best out of three. Here we snap. go. Snap! <laughs> oh. Did you that was a good one. Purpose? No, I got destroyed. I, I had a bunch of cheap cards in my hand. I'm like, no, I'm gonna get the expensive ones out. I get so tempted by the the pairs. I like saw an Elsa and an Anna in my hand, and I'm like, oh, if I get them both out, it's gonna be good. Going to sudden death. <laughs> Next person is the ultimate champion of tonight's game. <laughs> That's true. There are I like your new deck. Except for bragging rights for the rest of the weekend. Yeah. You just added, uh, which color did you just add? Was it red? Well, I just, um, yeah. Oh, yeah. no, I was playing with blue and gray. Yeah, and then you, you swapped gray for red. I like yeah. red. That's looking good. Okay. No. Is there music playing? Are they listening to us I think there's music. Yeah. Yeah, it looks like there's music. <laughs> Do -do -do. What? I don't think there's music playing. There's no music playing? Here, I'll play it louder. Do -do -do. Maybe that's too loud. Oh, here. We'll, we'll put it there. <laughs> All right, let's see. Do -do. Yeah, GG. That was that round. So what characters are you guys hoping come into this deck? Because it really seems like anything is up for grabs because, um, oh, I don't have it. Uh, it's Long over John there. Silver. <laughs> I, the, I have, I got Long John Silver from Treasure Planet. And like, that's showing me, like he's in the deck, he's in the green cards. And that's showing me that like any of these characters are up for grabs. I personally, really hope because they did treasure planet i really hope that that means they're going to bring in um uh lost atlantis i mean it, atlantis the lost empire yes I'd that would be cool i'd love to see akita and milo and those characters mm -hmm. i think that would be so cool okay the only characters i think have been announced for next round is that they've said that uh another mulan version is going to be in it and then also winnie the pooh is coming in it mm-hmm but who knows? Yeah, Mulan's really one could card be anything. we don't have. But yeah. I'm really hoping they dive into like the stuff that like never, <laughs> they never do. Yeah. What, what do you think would be- deserved. 
What do you think would be a really fun, obscure Disney card? I just said. Oh, which one? Sorry, I missed it. Atlantis Lost Empire. Oh my gosh, yeah, Milo. And that'd be awesome. And Princess Ikita. No, no, I want the guy that... Um... <laughs> Boom, no more Chinese laundry. <laughs> yeah, that, 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 I think he's like that Russian guy in I Atlantis. I like that guy, he's great. Oh, he's Italian, right? Or the mole? Oh no, yeah, I think he's Italian. Yeah, and it was the, yeah, the mole guy's fun. Yeah, um, that would be fun. I would like that a lot. Ooh, there's as someone saying, like, Deadman said, like, one dedicated just to Disney parks. Oh, that'd be fun. That'd be cool. The Hitchhiking Ghost, they that would really be a super cool card. They really, like, neat into it. I'd yeah. love to see, like, I don't know how they would do this in Villainous, because it's not really, like, specific bad guys. I don't know. I'd love to, I don't know. Yeah. Oh, we'll point it out this time. So, uh, someone noticed that there's actually hidden Mickeys on some of these cards. It reminded me of the parks. Um, yeah, you can actually see Mickey on some of these cards. I don't think I have one in my hand. Uh, Sebastian has some, some oops, I just said a card out loud. Has <laughs> some like very, very small ones. Um, but yeah, I'll, I'll show it when it, when it comes out. <laughs> okay. Who wants to go first? Why don't you go first? Okay. Yeah. Me? Why yeah. me? Because um, I want to see how much of a benefit it gives you. Okay. No. You, all right. We'll rock, paper, scissors. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Oh, shoot. Okay. All right. What do you want? <laughs> oh, well, now you made me think like I went first last time and I won. <laughs> <laughs> What do you think? I've never, okay, I'm gonna go with first. Just to right. try it. Sounds good. Cool. <laughs> Is that what I wanna do though? Yeah, I think so. Go for it. That's what you want me to do. Go for it. You go first. Bye. Okay. Okay. Jasmine. Very nice. Oh yeah, the pirates would be fun too. Pirates of the Caribbean. Fill up your brain. Look at the top two cards. There you go. Deck. Nice. Okay, so I'm gonna draw. I hope it's okay for me to go. Yep. Um, okay, we're gonna try new strat. All right, Sebastian's going away. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> hey, Sometimes our strengths lie beneath the surface, far beneath in some cases. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I feel that some days. <laughs> <laughs> are the cards that you know are going to be in the chapter two um, that you're looking forward to? We only oh, know two. Yeah, them. we only know. I think there's going to be a Mulan card, and I know there's going to be a Winnie the Pooh card. That's the only ones we know. Um, but there's definitely cards that I I hope will be in future chapters. Man, you got an Aurora out too. Off to a good start. Okay. I'm gonna. Are you gonna? Okay. Oh yeah, there's an action, so that, oh, that goes cards. away. Yep. Okay. All right, we gotta make some tough choices. Magic broom. Goodbye. And hello, Isma. Hey, hey's questing. Okay. Hey, hey. <laughs> hey, girl. Hey. <laughs> they say if you dream a thing more than once, it's sure to come true. Nice. And I've dreamed it so many times. I think one of my favorite things, <laughs> I think one of my favorite things that the uh, cards have is they have like a subtitle, because like, there's like multiple versions, like Yzma, the alchemist. Uh, hey Hey's is Boat Snack. <laughs> it's Hey Hey Boat Snack. Such a great card. Aladdin. Goodbye, Aladdin. Yeah. Okay. Okay, and then I'm just going to quest with her, I think. Okay, sounds good. All right, draw. Okay, we're gonna put. Um, it's nerve wracking. That. It is nerve wracking. We're gonna put Simba into our ink here. We're gonna spend that three ink. Cast my spell. When I play this Maleficent, I get to draw a card. And then um, Yzma is gonna quest. Oh man, I should have done that first because then I could have looked at it. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll put it on bottom. We'll see what we can get. 
Um, and then um, we're gonna quest. So that is two quests. Okay. Three to two. Mm hmm. Choices, 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 choices. <laughs> what are your choices? You know, you, like you would like to know. <laughs> Okay. All right, bye, Belle. When you play this character, each opponent loses a lore. <laughs> Down one lore. I've never played this with more than one person. Yeah, that's It'd true. Be interesting. Mm -hmm. uh, it'd be very, like, a lot of things happening. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm going to quest with Miss Aurora. Very and nice. And then I'm going to pay, oh no, I just did him three. Okay. That's it. Okay. Sounds good. I'm gonna draw. Okay, Sebastian is going down. And then I'm gonna spend three. Oh, and I need to put these back. I'm gonna spend three to play Maleficent to cast my spell. I will draw another card. Um, whoa. Okay. Do they all have hidden Mickeys? Um, no, but a lot of them do. <laughs> That's so fun. And then these three are all gonna quest. Um, Man, I keep forgetting to do that. Um, I keep forgetting to look at the top card of my deck with Yzma before I, okay, before I, I play this, because then I could choose to draw which card I want. Okay. You done? I'm done. Hmm, a lot of one-pointers on the board. I do. Slowly just gonna inch my way up. We're five to four, it's pretty close. Because you got this one that does two. I have to do it, Jasmine. Bye, Jasmine. She will be silent today. <laughs> <laughs> I am not a prize to be won. Okay, so I'm gonna pay four. Damn it. Oh my gosh, Pongo is tough. He's evasive. I can't I'm target him. I'm also gonna play one. Play this game. Oh, nice. Okay, and this then is getting scary. I'm gonna do two and one. Oh, but I should really take out. Oh. Um, Yzma. Okay, you're both taken out. There goes but my card filtering. Low, right? Okay, that was good. Yeah. That was a good idea. Yeah, it was. Okay. Draw. All right. So these are coming back up. And then I gotta make a tough choice. Cards. Um, yeah, you do. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna put Simba bodyguard down. I'm then gonna spend three and two um, to play Elsa and Yzma. Yzma's back. Yeah, Yzma's back. What the? I just <laughs> got gonna... rid of my Aladdin. <laughs> I'm gonna quest with Hey Hey. What the heck? Um, and then Maleficent's gonna take out Aurora. No. Yeah, get out of here. <laughs> that is, that's so themed. That's cool. <laughs> All right. Uh, oh yeah, this one can't quest yet, but I will quest with this one. All right. <laughs> Very nice. Come on, lucky number card I draw. Oh, I <laughs> Come on, card. Oh, I took these back. There we go. Okay. Okay, at least I can play it. <laughs> and these are in play. Yeah, they are. Yes, sir. Right, right, oh, sir. Right away, sir. <laughs> I love that they included Sergeant Tibbs from 101 Dalmatians. That's yeah. what I'm saying. Like they're like every they're bringing everyone in. They like, sure are. Really, really different characters in. Okay. Oh yeah, Nightmare Before Christmas would be super cool. Um, yeah, like Jack Skellington, Sally, Oogie Boogie. Do you see there's a new Oogie Boogie uh, villainous set that was just announced? Uh, it's gonna have glow in the dark Oogie Boogie dice, and they look awesome. Filled with fright. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm spending three. To do that, to reactivate. So you attacked once and then you're questing? No, I quested and now I'm doing oh, yeah, Shield yeah, of yeah. Virtue to reactivate. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm do Hey Hey. Okay. You can take out Hey Hey? I guess. With, with who? With Pongo? With Minnie. With Minnie? Oh, you can't take, because I have two health. Oh, you're right. You can use Pongo. Yeah. Okay, so you take one damage. Goodbye, Hey Hey. You will be missed. 
Okay. Okay. Sounds good. I will draw. Okay. So these come back up. Um, so here's a cool thing. You just got into Villainous last week. Well, welcome. Yeah, welcome that's awesome. Welcome to the team. <laughs> welcome to spending okay. all your money on it. All right. <laughs> Anna is in play. Loving Heart. When you play this character, if you have a character named Elsa in play, choose an opposing character. This character doesn't ready at the start of their next turn. What? <laughs> um, cool. So that's what I wanted. And then. What did he do to me? Just one, right? Uh huh. Yeah, just one. Okay, hang on. And then I gotta. Let's see. I'm gonna just go ahead and quest with everyone else. Quest. Quest. So that's three points. Oh, you're at 10, I'm at nine. This is a close game. And then I get to look at the top card of my deck and I'm gonna put it on the bottom. Oh, you have Elsa and Anna out? I do. It's like an all female power team over there. It is. <laughs> all right, come on, card draw. All right. This is my favorite art in the game. This Elsa is so cool. What you got? Hey, this doesn't ready. Oh, right. <laughs> get out of here with that. All right, I'm playing, Anna came in and saved the day. Playing the Gaston. Hero. This character can't quest and must challenge if able. Oh yeah, the reckless. Cool. Okay. Uh, so I'm gonna quest with both of them for two, and then I'm going to spin my three to activate this again to bring. It's just one character. I know. Yeah. I'm deciding who. Who she is. Let's do it with Hibs. Okay. Um. Yzma. Oh, there goes my Yzma again. And which <laughs> it kills Tibbs. All right. Not the cat. <laughs> okay. You all done? Yes. And all right. Draw. Two. All right. Hey, Hey's going to the trash. Um, and I'm going to spend four. The trash? Is that what you're calling the inkwell? <laughs> yeah. Um, <laughs> do I have any good in here? I do. Okay. I'm going to play um, Hades. When you play this character, return a character from the discard to your hand. I'll put Are you gonna in. freaking bring, okay, fine. No, not me, <laughs> <laughs> I'm bringing card draw back into my hand. Um, sorry, I gotta bring these back up. Okay, um, and I already did that this turn. Okay, so I'm going to quist, uh, I think. Ooh, where am I gonna do something better? Um, okay, I think I'm, Okay, I think both of these characters, rather than quest, no, they're, they're just gonna quest. We're gonna race. Here we go. So that's four. Do you have One, any cards? Two, here? Oh, three, you do four. Have cards. I do have cards. Yep. Is that it? Mm hmm. So you have one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, and I'm at 14, you're at 11. That's the problem with this game. I don't think it's a problem, but like all of a sudden you can be like really close <laughs> and like bleh, like points yeah. everywhere. I have a question because I've never played him. Sure. LeFou, when you play his character, ready chosen character, they can't quest for the rest of the yes. turn. Yes, so before you do that, you could basically like attack with Gaston or no, no, that would kill Gaston. You could attack with like mini and then attack with mini again. That's effectively what you could do. Or you could so quest I couldn't, and then attack. I couldn't make your characters. No, but like for instance, you could like quest with Pongo, get your two points, and then you could attack with Pongo. Oh man, I didn't see Pongo had two health left. I totally could have taken out Pongo. I should have done that. <laughs> then I'll do what you just said. Okay. So you're attacking with Pongo? No, or you're well, questing I'm and then attacking? questing with Pongo for two. And then go down and glory. And then I guess he's LeFou. The so when you play LeFou, Pongo can come back. Pongo yeah. comes back. Then and then I only had paid two, so I'm going to pay. Oh, Pongo is evasive. That's why I can't tar target him. Okay, I'm just going to do one for many. And then Gaston has to attack. Yeah. Um, he's just drowned. Everyone's a one-pointer. Oh no, Anna. 
Okay. okay. Anna. Gaston killed Anna. <laughs> and then I'm going to use my shield to reactivate, to use mini again. Okay. And I'm going to do some damage on just three health on Maleficent. I'll at least do some damage okay. on her. Sounds good. All right. Is that the end of your turn? No. Now I'm going to hit, I guess, Maleficent to take care of. Um, oh, we well, should have done it to Elsa then, yeah. right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So then now Elsa dies. Yeah. Yeah, okay. But then Pongo dies too? Yeah. But you got the characters out. Okay. All right. It's 14 to 14. It is 14 to 14. Okay, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put Jetsum in my inkwell. I'm going to pay seven. Do -do 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 -do. Here comes Carefree Surfer Stitch, which means um, I get to draw two cards because I have um, two people on two characters. Okay? And then these two are going to quest. No, 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 no. I got to take you out. Okay, this one's going to kill Minnie. And then, take damage. Yeah, I take one damage. Mm-hmm. And then this one's gonna quest. Oh, close game. Okay. Stitch has eight health. <laughs> yeah. Um, gonna play Mickey for three to bring a card into my inkwell. And then I'm just gonna quest with LeFou. So we're 15 to 15? Pay three, yeah, to fight with him. Um, hmm. Take out either one. I guess probably Hades then. Yeah, Hades. Deals more damage. Okay. It takes out with Sue. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. This is intense. I feel like we're playing this, more intense because we're on camera. This is very intense. Okay, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to spend three. I'm not and I'm gonna really spend nervous. So I'm going to spend three to put out Maleficent, which lets me draw a card. Um, I'm going to spend three to put out Maleficent, which lets me draw a card. <laughs> and then I'm going to put Hey Hey down in the inkwell. I'm going to spend my last two to put out Magic Broom. Oh no! which lets me um, sweep a card back into my discard. Um, but I'm not going to do that. Instead, I'm just going to quest with these two um, and get three points. Two, no. three. Um, okay, so that's an 18. <laughs> I think Literally I got you. playing blind. Here we go. <laughs> but I wouldn't be able to play him anyway. What? You can't play him? No, I can. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. I can play him. Hey, nice. But I can't play. Yeah, you can't use him yet. <sighs> mm -hmm. My only choice. Wait, it says ready a chosen character. Does it? Oh, but you need ink for that. I don't think that would work anyway. Okay. Does that work? No, but you also need ink for that anyway. Yeah, since they don't, I can't even hit you. The only choice I have is to use Mickey for 16. Okay. That's it. That's the game. That's game. Yep. So I spend one, I spend three, I spend four. The whole gang's out. <laughs> and then I'm going to have um, Maleficent saying uh, part of your world. <laughs> Man, you were able to... Good game, sir. Good game. Good game. Good game. Good game. <laughs> All so right. That's... Lorcana. That is Lorcana. Ah. That was a close one. Yeah. Very close. What did we end up at? Uh, 20 to 16, but it was 18 to 16 right before that. That was intense. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much for hanging out. Like you came back, like you had like zero cards on the board and then all of a sudden you I just did. like threw them up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, boom. <laughs> <laughs> um, but thank you guys so much for watching. We really appreciate you guys being here tonight. We think Fridays are going to be our normal nights that we're going to do game nights. So typically yeah. you can usually catch us More here reliable. at 8 o'clock uh, Eastern Standard Time um, on most nights. 
on this Friday night. Mm -hmm. uh, but as always, thank you guys so much for watching. And again, thank you so much to Robinsberger and Disney for providing some of the cards that we got to play with tonight. If you have any questions about Lorcana, make sure to leave them down below. We'll be happy to answer anything we know. But as always, we'll see you guys next time. Happy, happy playing. playing.